Wickian syndrome, also known as obesity hypoventilation syndrome, affects more than half of the population defined as obese. Those who struggle with daytime sleepiness, difficulty taking a full breath, and swelling of the legs and feet might have this syndrome. A person is identified as obese if he or she has a body mass index, or BMI, exceeding 30 kilograms per meter squared. Obesity, a BMI greater than 30, is the primary indicator that a person might suffer from Pickwickian syndrome, which is exclusively related to internal external obesity. For an in-depth review of Pickwickian syndrome, consult a medical authority. Below, however, you'll find the best ways to manage Pickwickian. The best news is that no one has to second-guess the most effective treatment. A person who isn't suffering from Pickwickian will still benefit from treatment because treatment is simply exercise and diet modification. Proper diet and exercise brings relief to the syndrome and its symptoms. With a proper pair of walking shoes, a daily fitness walk is the best and first exercise. Going out for 45 minutes and walking at a pace that requires the lungs to struggle is all that is necessary. One researcher explained the appropriate walk speed as being one at which a person can comfortably converse but could not sing. Research has shown that diet modification is the single most important consideration in dealing with obesity hypoventilation syndrome. When the word diet is mentioned, people have images of living on carrot juice for a month. Not so. There are many medically proven diets out there that are guaranteed to achieve weight loss without following the latest fad. It takes time for many obese individuals to deal with Pickwickian syndrome, but anyone who lowers their BMI to less than 30 will find relief. And the best news is that people who make strides in the right direction will notice measurable results along the way. Daytime fatigue, shortness of breath, and swelling all begin to reduce within days of beginning an appropriate diet and exercise regime, and will continue to improve until the symptoms all but disappear. For those who want to take charge of Pickwickian by diet and exercise, the rewards are achievable and noticeable.